here's a new tab. So you check, I did really well on understanding subtraction as adding the opposite. Or if you still don't understand it after the notes today, you would click, I'm going to need to redo this. Okay. And then you can click on this if you want to, and it'll take you directly to that assignment to redo it. Then you move on to the next one, B, subtracting negative numbers. Check your grade on power school, see if you've done it or if you need to redo it. C is combining like terms, check your grade on power school. D is number of solutions to an equation and E is finding their reciprocal. So that is what you need to do on part one. And at the bottom, you're gonna click on part two. Okay, here's part two. So up here in the left-hand corner, there's a link. This will take you to a page that shows you everything in this list. So it's gonna show you all 19 of these activities. These were the topics that were part of the unit test. So do you know how to do a one-step equation? Do you know how to solve an inequality from a graph? Do you know how to combine like terms with negative coefficients? Do you know how to do the distributive property? These were all in there. And each of these titles that are pink are assignments that are in your grade. So go ahead and check those in your grade, um, or you can just check from this link. It will give you one of these symbols. Gray means it's missing. You never did it. Gray with the little dot means you did it, but you got between 0 and 69%. Purple means you are above 70%. And then a double purple means 100. If you have a little crown on top, that means when you took the unit test, you had one question like that, and you got it correct as well as getting 100% when you practiced. So anything in this range, these first three categories, anything that has gray, except for this one with the gray without a crown, you can try these assignments again before the unit test. And your goal is look at your current unit test score. So you can see in this example, it's 80 percent look at your current score and then if you want to you can retake it on friday this is optional for those of you who want to raise your grade that's it